Yes, we are back with some more of Why in the Morning Entrepreneurship Tuesday, as I said earlier. I go by the name of Barry Moses, or it's Barry Moses on every social media platform. And our first segment of the day uh, involves a gentleman who's doing amazing work in the tech industry. He goes by the name Kenneth Matiba, and his, he is the CEO and founder of Tyro Tech. He's here in studio with me, Karibu Sana, Mr. Kenneth. Asante. All right, so it's, it's a pleasure to meet you, Kenneth. Pleasure to uh, Once I read about uh, Askari Wango up, I got fascinated by this. Yes, I've never seen something like this uh, in the country. I always complain about response time uh, when it comes to emergency, but now we have something like a scary wangu. But if I missed anything in the intro, you can say it, your camera is now. Okay, uh, thank you so much uh, for this opportunity. Uh -huh. uh, in Tyro Tech, we say we think different, uh -huh. and uh, we solve the problems that each that mona, the lowest mona inch is passing through. Mm -hmm. So in Tarot Tech, when I, I decided to come up with the, some of the solution, I did the content, then mm -hmm. I looked out for the best developers mm -hmm. uh, being supervised by me. Mm -hmm. And we said, what are the problems that mm -hmm. we are passed through that we can solve, or we can solve through tech? Mm -hmm. Therefore, I decided of immediate problem that I passed through personally, mm -hmm. that is security. Mm -hmm. uh, then the, I, that, that one made me to come up with uh, an app known as uh, uh, Askariwango. Right. Uh, Before we talk about Askariwango, um, uh, maybe you'd like to shed some light on your background in education. What did you study in school uh, before you got into this uh, nice. tech field? Uh, I did Bachelor of Commerce Finance Option. Uh -huh. Then since I graduated, I've uh -huh. been working on the IT firms. Uh -huh. Uh, I don't know, uh, maybe God had a purpose for that. Mm, as a financer. Uh, as a fi as I'm a financer and I was heading the sales and marketing team on uh, all the way through mm -hmm. in uh, IT firm. Mm -hmm. So I saw what IT firm can bring mm -hmm. and what the, how it, can, it, was, it has been solving the problems on the firm that I've, I've been employed to. So one day I decided if I can make this kind of money mm -hmm. with the background that I have, mm -hmm. Uh, to this IT company. Mm -hmm. What if I start my own company today? Mm -hmm. And that's how I grow passion. Mm -hmm. And I say, I'm going to start my own company, IT company that is going to solve a given problem. Because now I've, it found, uh, I had already get gotten in to mm -hmm. IT. Mm -hmm. And had, uh, I, had, I knew the challenges and the advantages of it. Mm -hmm. So when coming in, I was not concentrating on the advantages, mm -hmm. but I now was concentrating on how I can improve the disadvantages mm -hmm. and uh, that I found on the IT field uh -huh. yeah because most people were coming they, they are more system yes and more apps but they were not solving the existing problems okay. of one inch All right. so you need to understand the problems yeah. that the immediate population is Shh, facing true. before you come up with a, a solution to it exactly. understand the problem sure. first mm. what to Kenneth Matiba CEO and founder of Tyro Tech uh, he says you need to understand the problems of your consumers first true before you solve them so you solve back them. to Ascari Poa now um. uh, you are facing problems uh, with security, did you get robbed or something? Yeah, uh, uh, but by that time, where the estate where I lived, there was a lot of robbery, mm -hmm. a lot of theft uh, cases around there. So one day I was, I wake up uh, and I went to the stage when was I, I was when I was going to uh, my workplace. Uh, very early in the morning, six forty-five. So in the, in this bus, the robbers came in with the guns. Mm -hmm. The tellers put everything public down. Transport. Public transport. Very in Lucky Summer, I think it was in a lot in media. Mm -hmm. So uh, we were there, we gave our laptop, we gave our phone and wallets. Mm -hmm. And they were there for 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. So I said no. After that, I went down and do a content. Mm -hmm. What I passed through, I don't need somebody to pass through again. Mm -hmm. Then I said, if what if I come up with the emergency communication app mm -hmm. that can trigger the nearest police station or the private security agencies mm -hmm. to respond within seven to ten minutes mm -hmm. because by that time these people robbed us for over 30 minutes mm -hmm. if could we, if we could be having a given app mm -hmm. that can trigger uh, information mm -hmm. within this short period then these people could have not run away mm -hmm. or they could have not uh, uh, done anything wrong with uh, somebody uh, we could have just click a button mm -hmm. and the police or the private security firm could have been uh, could have, could have gotten the, the information the sooner you get to the scene the easier it gets to solve the crime yeah, sure mm -hmm. but you see it took 30 minutes mm -hmm. nobody came and they ran away from uh, they, they they took everything uh, uh -huh. from uh, from All us right. guys so i'm trying to understand uh, how this app works uh. yeah uh, so i have the app i click the button yeah the response button and then it notifies say the police yes police does 
it give them my location as well yeah uh, askari wangu is a very unique uh, is a unique uh, mm. is a unique app that has never been realized before in kenya uh, askari wangu just a simple definition of it is an emergency communication app when you are in the following emergency security hospital mm -hmm. accident mm -hmm. fire rape mm -hmm. and domestic violence mm -hmm. so l we have all those panicking buttons at a click of it it will pop up those panicking buttons so when you are in security distress you just click police and when you click police it will search the nearest police station mm -hmm. and it will search the nearest uh, security firm that we are partner with mm -hmm. the reason why we are partner with security firms most people don't believe in kenyan police but so, so far so good they have responded to our 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 our, our cases mm -hmm. within seven to ten minutes mm -hmm. but uh, now for backup we we came and uh, we decided let's partner with security firms mm -hmm. so that if they delay the security f uh, firms can private security firm can uh, can get in like stallion uh, sec mm -hmm. stallion security firm use on security firm and metro are within uh, we have them as our partners mm -hmm. so when you click let's say i click i'm here and i click the security panicking button it will say it will search the nearest pol police station and it will send kenneth matiba is in emergency and he needs immediate security response at this place so when they are coming they will not call me because i'm in emergency the app will be directing them to where i am so it sends the location as it's well. a, a live, GP, live gps location all right perfect this seems to be working perfectly yeah, so far sure. right so i what you're trying to tell me as a private citizen or in my home or in my workplace or my business yeah i don't really need to employ the security firms directly now you don't need i can get the app you can get the and app. then i can get the response the response just in from case them of anything whenever i need it perfectly i don't need the security guy to stand there for 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 a long time, for a long time. you need your phone as a security i need my phone as a security sure how much is it going to cost me to have this uh app? the it's going to cost you a hundred bob mm -hmm. We are charging this hundred bob per month. The reason why we are charging hundred bob per month that is three bob per day, mm -hmm. so that that mama boga should benefit from this app. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, if you charge, the reason why we are charging hundred bob is, if the let's say because we have only talked about security but remember the app has the panicking button for accident and the panicking button for fire and uh rape and domestic uh, domestic violence and rape cases so let's say you are seriously sick at night god forbid or your kid and uh, you don't you don't have a car and you click the ambulance we are in partner with red cross red, uh, st john ambulance uh, rumor nursing home and some of the hospitals mm -hmm. so when you click it's going to search the nearest ambulance mm -hmm. and red cross ambulance will come and pick you to the hospital uh -huh. if to the hospital, to the hospital. Uh, the and the advantage uh -huh. of that uh -huh. the app will s locate the nearest hospital so when ambulance comes uh -huh. to pick you it don't where. take you to any other hospital right. the app will direct them to the so I won't have to pay any fee for this ambulance. But, uh, we don't. We pay don't it out of hundred. Out people. of this hundred shilling. Sure. So the only fee I need to pay is is hundred per month. Yeah. When I get to the hospital, if I'm not insured, that yeah, is, you so I'll need to pay. Need to pay, is, but but the transport is is catered for. Wonderful, amazing. Yeah. I yeah. like the work. That so you guys that's the are reason doing. why we are charging hundred. All right, that yeah. is the reason why you're charging hundred. Yeah. Another thing I'd like to get to know: mm. uh, rape and domestic violence yeah. is a uh, is a. Uh, is is a sad thing is a sad reality sure so and uh i don't think rape and domestic violence uh, is can be handled effectively yeah by the police sure who responds to these cases uh like in rape the first in the, th the first thing that should always happen it uh, uh the first thing that should open when someone is raped the first thing is to go to hospital so we always give when you are in rape you click ambulance part of it so that this ambulance can come and take you there so the first to the, to the hospital then uh, because when you're in the hospital even the police can come and do a recording of what Which happened report, yeah the, 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 the nurses, the nurses can, yeah, can do a report for uh -huh. you so at a, we always encourage uh, our girls and our uh, our our daughters mothers mm -hmm. aunties to have the app so in case of anything happens to them mm -hmm. we are not praying for that to happen because mm -hmm. uh, uh, it, it can happen but either it's way a sad yeah it can happen yeah it can happen so mm -hmm. when you click the ambulance can come there immediately to take you to the hospital mm -hmm. because uh, we need always the first thing is to get medication mm -hmm. they check up on you before any other thing this is uh, amazing progress yeah. for our women and our ladies out yeah. there in uh, in fighting rape sure so you found your way uh in the tech industry yeah. to help curb 
this vice right here. Sure. I like that as much as you're in in this business to make money, you're yeah. also impacting lives in, in a life. very special way. Sure. I like to focus on another app that you guys have created, and this one is The Mechanic, the, the mechanic. which is also very interesting. Uh, tell me more about this. Uh, the Mechanic is a, a very uh, interesting app. As I told you, there is no any app that we are coming up with that uh, is solving a problem that I've, no, I, I've, no, I've not passed through. Uh -huh. I sat it down, I said, what are the problems that I passed through that I so can't change? the problems change? you go through inspire you. In inspire me to come up with uh -huh. the app. There's a day that we are going, we, I was traveling to Nyakach and uh, we were stuck at 6 a, I mean 12 a.m. in the morning and we didn't have any other mechanic around. We were there up to 6 a.m. I mean, uh, from 12 a.m. to uh, 12, uh, 12 to 6 a.m. waiting to find a, ma a mechanic. Mm -hmm. So I decided, no, nobody will pass. No, will, is not going to pass through the, this uh, this problem again. That's why I came up with. The, I did a content and I brought my uh, my developers together and we said we want to do this. Uh, so my mechanic has a very unique uh, a very unique app that helps you locate the nearest mechanic mechanica or uh, breakdown when your car has a technical pro i mean uh, develops a mechanical problem let's say you are traveling to migori and uh, on the way, in the middle of the road, your car develops a mechanical problem. That means that that car cannot be ma uh, that cannot be repaired uh, from where it is. It has to be to, uh, uh, to, uh, to, uh, to another place. Uh -huh. So. Remember, you, do, you are not walking. Uh, you are not walking around with the breakdowns. Uh -huh. So you just click. You just uh, uh, get into your mechanic app. Uh -huh. y it will search the nearest breakdown. <laughs> And the the nearest breakdown will come and take you uh, to to the nearest and garage. If it's a minor problem. That just it's a minor a problem, and the mechanic uh, the car is uh, a place where it can be uh, it can be serviced. Mm -hmm. You just click the app. You go uh, because in, if you click the app as a, as a client, mm -hmm. it takes it has three uh, three modules. Mm -hmm. Number one is breakdown. Number mm -hmm. three is the auto electric el electrician. Mm -hmm. Then number two is general mechanic. Mm -hmm. So you know your car. Mm -hmm. If you see, if you find that there is something wrong with your car, you mm -hmm. say. This maybe it's just a minor wiring. Uh -huh. You don't look for general mechanic. Uh -huh. You click auto electrical mechanic. Uh -huh. So I mean, uh, it will search for the electrician uh -huh. who will come and sort you. But right. if it's a general mechanic, uh, uh, general mechanic that you need, uh, you don't know what is happening in your car. Uh -huh. You will come and click general mechanic and research the nearest mechanic. Then right. another thing this time, we have something a diagnosis machine. Mm -hmm. Now it is very hard to find the cars that are coming in. You have to have that machine to identify the, the, problem, the problem of the yeah. car. So yeah. uh, when you are, when the mechanic is registering, the app will ask him, t uh, the, the, the app will ask him, sorry, him or her, have you, do you have a diagnosis machine or not uh -huh. so even if now if you if you are searching for mechanic you will if you need a mechanic with a diagnosis or machine or not uh -huh. you will you can easily you can get specify. you can specify so uh, it uh, you can order a mechanic or a breakdown yeah according to your specification sure. according to the problems uh, according, to, according problem. to the way you understand yeah it. even uh we have even label kind of vehicle that they ma uh, that they make because mm -hmm. the, there's a, someone who can make Japan cars and mm -hmm. someone who cannot make Jap J Japan cars. There's uh -huh. someone who can make Germany cars. There's someone who cannot make uh, Germany cars. So right. it specifies it tells you which kind of vehicle you have, All and right. it brings you a list of the mechanics around you who can make that kind of type of car you have. I'm trying to understand the process because yeah. you have made uh, these applications to detail. I'm sure. trying to understand the process. Uh, you don't have a background in 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 mechanics or engineering yeah how do you get to these details to these fine details how is the the, the creative process like the uh, the creative process part of it when a mechanic has decided there is a slight interview that they do mm -hmm. in the app mm -hmm. so before we accept them we confirm them to be part and parcel of Tyro Tech, mm -hmm. there are some of the stages that they pass through. Mm -hmm. There are a lot of questions that we ask before we give them an okay. Mm -hmm. So that, make us in, uh, that makes us have a credible and a trusted uh, mechanics. List of mechanics. A list of mechanics. I get that. Yeah. You have a trusted list of mechanics. Yeah. But I'm interested in the creative process, the development of the app. Because mm -hmm. uh, you guys are from different backgrounds. Yeah. How do you make sure that you have 
develop the app to detail like the one you're telling me about yes is it like a conference meeting mm. where you write the algorithms on the board like we see in the movies no uh, what we do yeah. i sit down i come with the content mm -hmm. we have our offices along gong road mm -hmm. and we have over 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 seven developers mm -hmm. uh being led by someone known as elijah mm -hmm. shout uh, out to elijah uh, for <laughs> making the world a better place, yes, a better uh, place. and then we have ben uh, shout out to ben as well <laughs> then, as mentioned, won't it? then we have dan uh -huh. we have a, a very young a uh, young fellow that is uh, is is still schooling but we give them opportunity to prove what he is uh, sam from ranga university then we have masi from um Chuka University, mm -hmm. they are good. Uh, they are good developers. Then we have another one, Dixon, mm -hmm. that I can't forget. Mm -hmm. So when once I have this content, we, we go in a boardroom. Mm -hmm. I tell them that this is what I have in mind. Mm -hmm. How are we going to make this thing to be a pro uh, to solve a problem? Mm -hmm. Each and every person will give his view. Mm -hmm. And uh, on de when developing a app, we have four a four part of it. Mm -hmm. We have front end, mm -hmm. we have user interface, mm -hmm. we have back end, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, and uh, we have web web app. Right. So each and every developer will take what he or she is best in. Mm -hmm. And once they are done, we come and integrate it through APIs and it goes live. Wow, wonderful. Yeah. Teamwork makes the dream work. It How does. much would it cost me to get onto the me my mechanic? Mechanic is free of charge. Mm -hmm. The only way we charge, uh, we don't charge uh, our clients, clients, we uh -huh. only charge mechanics. Uh -huh. When we connect to Because you've the created business for sure, them. Yeah. Makes a lot of sense. Yeah. All right. So, uh, there's a lot going on at Tyrotech sure, uh, currently, is. and uh, questions are coming in. Yeah. People have tried to find the, the first app that we talked about, Askari Wangu. Yeah. They've tried to find it online, but they can't find it. What's yeah. going on? Uh, oh, I, as I just told you mm -hmm. where, before you came on air, mm -hmm. number one, we wanted uh, the the Google regulation said that you cannot post an app less than two dollars. Mm -hmm. So when we place it on app on uh, 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 stating two dollars, what happens mm -hmm. is that people are getting it hard because we place an uh, when you Google ask mm -hmm. it was charging two hundred mm -hmm. as, as you download. Mm -hmm. So this was very uh, tending to be hard, and some of the payment uh, uh, payment modes were M-Pesa Express and debit, and you find that some of the uh, some of the phones that don't have M Pesa. and Kenyans fear using their cards online so we we, we were do, uh, there is uh, it we find it hard and to our clients who need to use our services so what happens uh, from yesterday uh, from Friday we were making a developing credit coding and in purchase payment mm -hmm. so this morning we removed the app from the play store mm -hmm. so that we fix the in purchase payment whereby you can download the Skariwango for free but you pay for the service uh -huh. so before the end of the day and or tomorrow morning uh -huh. the app will be up and running yes before the end of the day the app will be up and running back yeah. on google Play Sh uh, sure. all right uh, the ios crew are asking yeah. are they covered as well uh, the, uh, uh, they are not covered yet uh -huh. we call, in us in our town we call it hybrid uh -huh. but uh, there is uh, the two guys Elijah and uh, sam are working on the uh, on the ios uh, ios version uh -huh which before the end of this month all our apps are going to be having the ios mm -hmm. but the one that we are developing as per now are, are uh, they are going to come on two uh, these uh, two, two versions but as kariwango and my mechanic are only on, on androids but we are making sure that before the end of the uh, before the end of the month uh, they, we have both uh, both versions all right yeah. so through making uh, these changes like the changes you're making today yeah. you've learned a lot in the process yeah we have learned all a right lot. so what can you tell us about the process because uh, people want to get rich overnight yeah yes people want to bet People want to get loans that they can service. Uh, so, what do you? What What does the process mean to you? Uh, the process uh, means a lot to me. Mm -hmm. As youth, we like things that are ready, mm -hmm. that are ready. We don't like process one, two, three. Mm -hmm. uh, this job made me to be fired. Mm -hmm. uh, what I do, mm -hmm. they saw me uh, her on live TV. The way I am <laughs> like today. this, and they so said, this uh, might also yeah, get you in trouble. Uh, they, it cost me a trouble, but I don't uh -huh. regret. Uh -huh. It has made me influence. It has made me employ some guys today. Uh -huh. uh, it has made me think outside the box, and it has made me come with a uh, solution mm -hmm. to much more problems. Mm -hmm. So uh, process is uh, always de needs determination. Mm -hmm. And you know what you want. Mm -hmm. I always have one advice to our youth that uh, a process is a process. Uh, oh, this uh, this life is like a relay. Mm -hmm. A relay is where I give you a stick, mm -hmm. then you give another person a stick. Mm -hmm. 
in the real in on the way this stick can fall uh -huh. but if the stick falls and you go uh, you, you go ahead and uh, and finish the race uh -huh. without the stick even if you're number one you'll not be counted you number one counted. you have to go uh -huh. back and pick the stick and uh, uh, clear make uh, sure, uh, uh, make sure to the finish line. get uh -huh. to the finish line so it's the same thing is a process uh -huh. a process is the best thing start from somewhere so that when you're up tomorrow you're up there tomorrow mm -hmm. you can trace where you started mm -hmm. from no that's waking up you need uh, you need something to do uh, you need some uh, you need uh, you get you want something uh, things happen from uh, from uh, from nothing so start from somewhere idea is best than money mm -hmm. believe me i started this thing without any kind of seal, uh, any coin but today tyrotech is paying Salaries, uh, salaries and paying taxes, okay, taxes as well, taxes as well uh -huh. and paying my bills today so Wonderful. it started from somewhere it started so from let's somewhere. Uh, as you should not just be uh, we need ready things mm -hmm. ready things at times they are expensive to mm -hmm. us and they can cost our lives all right yeah i'd like to focus on the last aspect uh of the business yeah. the most i think this is the most important aspect yeah. the idea might be great sure uh, the product might be amazing sure. remarkable but getting it to the consumer yeah. and getting the consumer to understand it sure. is the most important it's the most thing. important. So uh, I know there are very many app developers out there who are watching right now. Yeah. What is your style of getting the app or the product to the consumer and getting them understand this? Considering not everybody has a background in IT or, or programming or computer knowledge or computer skills. Uh, on, on, on taking the product to the market... Uh, because in IT we have two things, uh, we have development, uh, development, business development part of it, and app development part of it. Yes, development in the room will be much more easier. Mm -hmm. But how are you going to convince someone that this app is going to uh, uh, is you. going to help them yeah. change uh, your or life. change your life? Uh -huh. Especially in Kenya, most of uh, we haven't uh, accepted that take to be part the culture, uh, the the culture, culture. Uh, to right. be part yeah. of us. So uh, how I take it outside there, we have a, v a good group. Uh, a, a good a good group of sales and marketing team that are well trained well educated of on on our apps so they go out there if they know what they are going to sell and we don't sell our apps we sell a solution that's where people get it wrong they are going to sell the app instead of selling a solution that this problem that this app is going to solve so as we don't tell us Skariwang, we sell the problem uh, the solution that Skariwang is going to bring so it should go something like have you ever experienced this? yeah then we can solve this in we this can solve not this. have you no. heard of this app? no all right we wonderful do. words from you thank yeah. you very much for thank coming you. through to why in the morning uh, before you can go uh, your social media handles and the website and how they can get to interact with these apps and how they can get to learn about them okay uh, our social media account uh, let me start uh, apart from developing uh, mm -hmm. our apps we develop any kind of apps mm -hmm. so if you want an app or, or any kind of system you call you can contact us right, if i have an idea and i yeah. don't have the developers yeah. i don't have the capacity to yeah. develop you can, can contact at the very cheapest right, place right, right. Uh, we have our headquarters at ngong road just nazarene complex mm -hmm. just up beside coptic plaza mm -hmm. we have branch in migori we have a branch in uganda mm -hmm. we have a branch in kisumu and Eldoret coming soon next mm -hmm. week uh, you can find us uh, on Facebook at uh, Tyrotech or World Tyrotech Solution Worldwide, uh, on Twitter at Tyrotech Solutions. Mm -hmm. Uh, then our office numbers are zero seven nine one six seven nine four nine nine. Thank you very much, sir. Yes. Thank you for making uh, the world a better place. Thank you so Kenya much. in particular. Thank you so much. We appreciate Tyrotech. Thank you. All right, so yeah, this is Kenneth Matiba, the CEO and founder of Tyrotech. Uh, they are finding, uh, the, they're finding solutions to the Kenyan problems, to the local problems. You can find them on social media as uh, Tyrotech, yeah. right? Hilda Othiti is coming up next with another interview, so don't go nowhere, don't touch that down.